Hey everyone and welcome to the 20th episode for Dawn of War Dark Crusade campaign with Tau Empire faction. In the previous episode I took control of Oristan Plains region and I said I will go and take uh, Space Marine Stronghold now, but I changed my mind. I think I will fight uh, back these Space Marines here on Panrea Lowlands and this region, the Aerial Highlands. It will also give me the last uh, special ability, uh, Bulwark. I gain control of production facilities, making defensive preparations easier. Uh, reduces cost of garrisoning troops in provinces you control. Likewise, reduces the amount of planetary requisition recovered when withdrawing those troops. Doesn't affect cost of retraining honor guard units. So yeah, these two regions, I think, will be completed now. Let's go on Panrea Lowlands first. Uh, these space marines are very easy to fight. We'll just... Uh, Take a look in the archive, if you're interested, pause the video and read this. Let's get started. I am not sure, did we fight uh, Space um, Eldar in this campaign so far? I don't think we fight them yet. But we'll fight them in this episode. Barracks, four generators, two self suits. And Tau Commander will go and scout. I think Space Marine Base might be here. Build barracks faster and generators. Okay, it tries to rush me. Let's focus this Force Commander. Just focus the Force Commander. Uh, this uh, stealth suit will get here and take the point. Below half HP already. For the Force Commander. Tau Commander weapon has very high damage to everything. The tier 3 weapon is very good. Probably the best weapon on any Commander. Focusing his generators, then I will take down these scouts. They don't care that Tau Commander sits here and destroys their base, they need the point. Okay, kill them then. Do more upgrades, and I will need to go tier 2. Oh, where are you going, man? Go back. Two turrets from Space Marine. Alright. Get this point. And go tier 2. Although I don't think tier 2 is required at all. These Space Marines are too easy to fight. I think I can defeat them with the Tau Commander alone. They're just not strong in this campaign, I don't know why. More generators required. Destroy this turret already. Get closer so that the drone will also shoot. It goes down quickly. Nice drones, by the way. Offensive and defensive drone. Wait, wait. You get the middle. 
And I will do the global upgrades. One more generator. By the way guys, let me know what other um, Warhammer 40k games would you like to see on my channel. I think I will do Dawn of War 2 campaign for all other games. Not very sure if uh, my computer will handle them with the recording. I can play them on the highest when I'm not recording, but... With recording it's, it requires more CPU, so uh, it's hard to say, I need to try it. And I don't think I will play Soulstorm campaign, it's pretty boring. Dark Crusade is already quite boring, but Soulstorm is even more so. So I don't even know, is it worth it? Maybe I will do it sometime in the future if there will be a high demand for that, but I don't think this, that will, will uh, happen. The campaign is not really good in Soulstorm, the online is good in Soulstorm, it was good at least. Now the game is pretty dead, to be honest. Especially after uh, Dawn of War 3 came out. One of the reasons I do not play Soulstorm anymore. A broken lobby, the same players for years. Basically no fun in the game anymore. But I will still um, get out some replays, some good replays from good players. <laughs> it's always entertaining to watch them. Also, replace, old replays from Dark Crusade will be recorded more and more. I've got plenty of them. And those Dark Crusade replays are extremely high level, by the way. Uh, played by the best players ever in Dawn of War history, probably. Such players as uh, Servant, Santiago uh, and many others. There were actually lots of good players in this game back in 2006-2007 and even up into 2010 I think many of them still played. So recording and watching them how they play it's pretty entertaining. Can you see that I deal with this Space Marine base with a Tau Commander alone? I don't even need my rest of the army. I don't even need to make it. Easy mission again. Let's just finish them. Get a vehicle beacon up. Don't know if I will need it. Stealth suits. My income is plus 234. That's very high economy. Librarian or chaplain or who is there? Or maybe both of them. Let's see. Yeah, they struggle moving. This is so buggy. I wonder why the Space Marines are so bad in the campaign. At least maybe their stronghold won't, won't be as easy as this mission. And I hope uh, Eldar will be more powerful. 
We are done with Pandria Lowland. Veteran stealth team earned. Now it's time to go to this region. Let's attack. I will get my tier 2. And that will be enough, I hope. Here is the archive. Pause and read if you're interested. Let's get started. This is a uh, very big map, map, by the way, with lots of strategic points, and this is only a four-player map. Okay, get barracks up and some generators. And on such maps, uh, the AI can be very dangerous because of the amount of strategic points. They can mass up lots of units, and they never get tired. And there's also two two elder bases. This might be quite challenging, actually. We'll need at least four stealth suits because look, look how many strategic points on this map. This is crazy. Two relics, three critical locations, and a ton of strategic points. Get two fire warriors now. Oh, I see a viper already. Destroy him. Thankfully my Tau commander has um, and also anti-vehicle weapon. Uh, this weapon, uh, our long-ranged one, is good against everything. Arlequin. Relax, man, and get lost. Let's take these points. You take these ones. Three stealth suits waiting. Okay. More builders also required. Already running pretty low on resources to capture the map faster. Bunches, bunches can be a headache. Now actually cancel one generator. You go here. Not bad, good attack from Eldar from the start. Create this. And make the optics. Yeah, they cannot see my Tau Commander now. Just need to focus on getting the map. That's all that has to be done. And building also the listening posts. Nice. So, first elder attack fails. At this point. Global upgrade and one Pathfinder team. I need to defend here at home because um, Elder can get to my base from two sides. So I need to defend for the start. 
I have no idea where they can get from Okay, Pathfinder get also here Not enough builders, two of them are dead Need to make again Focus is real. Hard to say something. Well, let's go for vehicle beacon, I guess. Right here in the base, in the safety location. Now we can start the overwatch. The income on. Um, Requisition is crazy high. I will have enough resources for everything. Send us toward the enemy. Stealth team ready for next assignment. The technology of Tau makes us. And I don't even have half of the map captured yet. Oh, retreat. Dies on the fly. Okay, let's make some drone herbingers. We'll need to go tier 3 soon. And of course, versus Elder, I will go for Kayon. The only way, I guess, is Kayon. Yeah, they get crazy now. I think they have a lot of resources. And they are preparing to attack me. Banshees. Banshees can be a pain. Let's make the drones. Need to mark the Banshees. Okay, everything is fine for now, stop the production of drones. Now need to gather some resources for Kayon. Controlling also two criti critical locations. Which helps me with map vision a lot. Okay, time for Kayon, let's go. Like this. Should be okay. Again, bunches. Get them marked. What is this army doing? They don't even focus my uh, stealth suits. I didn't get them. They need a bigger army. I feel some threat incoming by seeing all this. Tier 1 Elder Units Tier 1, but there's lots of them Tier 1 and Tier 2, because Banshees also and Early Queens are out Okay, we're fine Time to make some more drones
crazy. Okay, I'm ready. Now I need more energy. Not enough energy. Everything goes into the drones. Global upgrade required. Whoa, how many elder here? This can be dangerous. Need to prepare faster. Make this KN upgrade in the first place. Get more army out. Uh, this might be quite long. Yeah, Elder takes them back slowly. I see. Still not enough energy. One more global upgrade then. And I need this armor upgrade. Now I need to split my army in two. I will need some army for defense of my base and some army will go and destroy elder bases slowly. I think part of that army that will defend will be mostly infantry and the vehicles will go and destroy elder. Let's get them here. Oh yeah, look at this. And coalition center also is required for ethereal and bodyguards will be very useful also for defense. So I think this army will be left here. The rest of the army I will get on this side now and start from um, the bottom side of the map towards the top side. But I need still bigger army and I need to go tier 4. One more stronghold perhaps also would be a good idea, make it here, not enough energy again. Okay, this army also will go and attack. And this stealth suit on this side. Also one Pathfinder on that team will be needed. Nice. Bodyguards will stay right here in the base on the high ground. Pathfinders will get here. Can you see that Elder cannot approach? That's great for me. Another John Herbinger will get to this side. And also capture these points. Still a good soundtrack for Dawn of War 1. Uh, many people don't like uh, this music, don't know why. 
And I think it's really good. There are very good tracks in this uh, soundtrack, and I, th I think it was uh, composed by Jeremy Soule. A very good producer, one of my favorites. He also produced um, all the soundtracks for The Elder Scrolls until Skyrim. From Morrowind, I think. Okay, tier 4 has to be done. Two more upgrades, and these upgrades maybe. Now let's move slowly. Stronghold ready, and I needed this for building more generators, of course. I don't have enough energy. Okay, capture also these coins. And I will need a builder in here to build them. Make also a broadside team. Maybe the crude shapers get this building up. And start summoning more drones. Dealing with them slowly but surely. Jump in their base, here it is. One base is probably here on the bottom side, and another one might be here. Pretty sure about that. Still remember this mission a bit. Get all these beasts here. Man, my army is huge already. Why these elders do not attack? They just staying in there, doing nothing. Nice, I love these drones. Especially with Kayun upgrades, they are very good. Capture these points. Guide our efforts. 
And I need the Harbinger closer to this base. Yeah, I see Eldar has infiltrated his buildings and I don't see them. Need the Pathfinders, or the Tau Commander at least. But Tau Commander is busy defending the base. So I will need these Pathfinders. Is to capture. Okay, stop the drone production for now. And here it is, the Elder Base now revealed. One Elder Base gets destroyed here one more remaining what do you want population full now we'll get through this way towards the next Eldar base. Still, this army will stay here. Maybe only a few will move. Let's get these Crude Hounds moving and the Crude Ox. In this direction. And here they are, not so far away, but this is not their base, the base might be here. I see three falcons, strange. Get some drones in there. I think they started to panic. That's why I attack me. Spam more drones now again. I think this won't last for too long. We're about to finish. My population is full. We have huge economy. Over ten, over eleven thousand in reserve of requisition. That's so much. I don't know why they do not make more powerful units. They only made like Guardians, Banshees, Arlequins, that's all I've seen. Where are the Warp Spiders? Where are the Fire Prisms? Where's the Avatar? They don't make these units. Okay, just let's get in their base and destroy them.
Upgrade all the points. How many drones? Get them all in the other base. Here we go, two LP3s and lots of web gates. What's this? Nice placement, by the way, it looks quite good, but in fact it's stupid to place all these web gates in one place like this, not the best idea. points for me. Oh, warp spiders, really? Okay. Where is the drone harbinger? Oh, it, it's here, okay. Aspect portal around, destroy it. And I need my pathfinders, again, I don't know where are they. I don't see my pathfinders. Oh, they are here, okay. Here it is, the web assembly. Yeah, this is probably the first region where we fight Eldar. And this wasn't easy, that's good, a good sign. I think uh, next missions against them also will be quite challenging. I hope so, at least. We are done with them here. And one more region is under my control now. Ariel Highlands. In the next uh, episode I will end turn and probably attack the Space Marine Stronghold. I don't even know what to do, but we'll see. I will attack Space Marine in the next episode, then I will go in the 22nd episode to this region. And in the last one we'll get the Elder Stronghold on Tyria. Probably that will be the order. Uh, that's it for now, guys. Thank you for watching. Leave your feedback below the video. Leave a like or a dislike. And I will see you next time.